happy Friday, almost fall, everybody. <laughs> Hope you're having a great week. Uh, we have a body weight, total body burn today. So you need nothing but a mat, grab some water, and we'll get started in about a minute. The music um, is transitioning right now, but if you can't hear my voice, there we go, or the music, please let me know. Again, if you're just hopping on, we have a body weight, total body burn today. There's a lot of things to say. So grab water, grab a mat, and we'll get started in here in about 20 seconds. If you're having trouble hearing myself for the music, let me know. All right, let's start jogging in place. Super wide, bend into one knee, one leg, and out the other. So our format today, we'll talk as we're warming up. Um, you've seen it before, we've done it a couple times. If you've taken class with me, last one and then turn your heels in, toes out, sumos. Um, 45 seconds of work, 15 seconds of um, a, uh, sorry, what did I say? Of a active recovery move, there we go. So it can either be a jog in place, it can be high knees if you want more, okay? You can simply be moving the arms. I'll give you options as we go. Basically, it's five minutes of work. Bring 10 toes facing me, set it back for squats, and then we rest, right? We go through three times, 15 minutes of work, and we'll finish with planks. Last one, and front kicks, opposite arm, opposite leg. Take that right leg back and forth, opening up the hip. And left leg. Good, big arm circles forward. Big arm circles back. Cross them over your body, and we'll get started. Okay, so the moves that you need to know, we've got a 180 burpee, so we're gonna start here. We've got to jump back, forward. Our twist is our jump. Back, in, twist to jump, okay? And then we continue. So, after that, you're gonna do some sort of active recovery. I'm going to probably jog. Okay, if you want more, you can do high knees. You can do butt kicks. You can simply move your arms. I want you to move in some way in between to continue to move. Then we've got push-ups. Okay, so we're going to come down to the ground. We've got push-ups. I don't care if you go wide or close. Okay, we're going to reach that arm out, tap the shoulder, back down. Reach out, tap, down. Out, tap, and down. Kneeling works as well. We've got a jump lunge, okay? We're here, switch, switch. Works for rear lunges as well if you're choosing not to jump. I'll give you options. Okay, we're gonna walk our inchworm out. Okay, we're gonna find that. We're gonna find an open side plank. 
open side plank, and then we're gonna walk it back. Okay, so you may only get a few in because that one's gonna take a little bit longer. And then we finish with skaters, so we've got space side to side, skaters behind the back, behind the leg. Okay, so find your space. You know that you're gonna need space forward and back as well as lateral. Forty-five on, fifteen active recovery, five minutes straight. We ready? I'll give options. Okay, not to worry. Three, two, and one. So we jump back in. Big twist to jump uh, to turn around and twist. Or step back, step forward, up and turn. Back, forward, up and turn, okay? Your call. We're halfway now. Ten seconds. Last five, four, three, two, one. Some sort of active recovery. I'm gonna jog in place as we get ready for push-ups. Five seconds and we'll make our way down. Four, three, two, and one. We're on the ground for a push-up. Right hand reaches, taps the shoulder. Left hand reaches, taps the shoulder. Push up. Right reach, tap, down. Reach, tap, down. Push up. Okay? It's kind of like a, uh, like an X, I guess. Cross your body. Forward, cross, and down. 20 seconds to go. Kneeling works as well. Ten seconds. Last five, four, three, two, one. Bring it up to stand. Some sort of active recovery. Mine's a jog. We've got our lunges next. Jump lunges in three, in two, in one. Here we go. So big jump or rear lunge. Tap in and lunge. Tap in and lunge. We're halfway there. Last 10. Five, four, three, two, one. Active recovery. Some sort of movement. We've got inchworms to that side plank. Start to come towards the back of your mat. Three, two, one. Arms up, walk it out. Right side plank, big twist. Left side plank, big twist. And we walk it back. Arms up, we walk it down. Option, drop the knees. Right side plank, and down. Left side plank, and down. We walk it back. Halfway there. Like I said, you may only get a few in here, right? Because they're going to take a little bit more time, and that's fine. Last 10 seconds. Try to squeeze one more in. Five, four, three, two, one. Active recovery. We've got skaters. I'm moving my watch because knowing me, I'm gonna end up falling on it. All right, three, two, lateral, and one. Here we go, skaters. So I'm not gonna choose to tap my hand down right now at least. You can. You can step for skaters. Okay, that's where I'm at right now. You can come all the way down to tap. Halfway. Last 
last ten. And five, four, three, two, one. Active recovery. And rest. Good job. Full on minute break. And we'll go round two. Not too bad, right? Kind of goes fast. You know the moves now, as always, so we know where to modify. Right? Uh, I'll give more modifications, or I'll try to get more modifications as we go. But for the time being, you have probably two or three ways to do everything, right? Alright, calm your breath. You've got 15 seconds. We've got that 180 burpee again for round two. Only three rounds, so stick with me. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and here we go. So we jump back, in, big twist, back, in, big twist. Or step, step, stand. If you don't want to jump at all, you can turn. Just step, turn. Right here. Twenty seconds. Last five, four, three, two, one. Active recovery. So again, I'm jogging. You can go arm circles. You can crisscross. Okay, do what you want to do. Just move in some sort of way. Push-ups. Here we go. Come on down. Push up. Right arm forward. Across. Down. Left. And push up.
Last five, four, three, two. Walk it all the way back. Active recovery. Turn lateral on your mat. We've got skaters. Five seconds, four, three, two, and one. Here we go. So I'm not placing my hand down right now. Okay, you can. You can step. You can maybe even hold like a little bit more of a, a lateral bound, single leg balance. Halfway. Last 10. Five, four, three, two, one. Don't forget your recovery. Active recovery for 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And then full rest. One more round, you guys. So just so I can, um, I just want to tell you now so you don't get your hopes up. After our last round, we do have plank. And we're going to have time. So we're going to do a few. So don't get to the end and let everything out, okay? Make sure we continue. Just know that that's coming. So that it's not a surprise and that's so you guys don't scream at your phone when you hear that coming. You can still do that, I don't care. You have about 20 seconds to go. Last round. Ten seconds, and five, four, three burpees, two, one, here we go. recovery. 10 seconds, push-ups are coming. Three, two, one. Here we go. Do your best to keep your hips uh, line up with the mat, okay, as you get more tired, as I and myself, you're going to start to want to sway those hips. Do your best to keep them equal or even with the mat. Square them up. Oh, finish up strong. 10 seconds. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. We're up. For active recovery. My arms officially tapped out after that one. We've got this, you guys. Almost there. We've got lunges in three, in two, in one. Let's go. Active 
recovery. Awesome job, you guys. I'm still here. Just give me a second. My computer wants to sleep. So we're going to go into those um, inchworms. And here we go. Arms up. Walk it out. Find that twist. Maybe. The last 10 seconds, give it all you've got, all the energy left. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. Active. You guys. All right, take a rest. We're gonna finish up the plank series. Again, we've got the time. Take your full minute, and we'll come back. So we usually do that minute, right? That minute plank finisher. We're gonna go. We're gonna follow suit with our um, the rest of our workout today. We're gonna go 45, but 15 off, and we've got three. You ready for this? Start to come down to your mat. Don't go into any type of plank pose yet. Stay seated on your heels or kneeling or something just to keep the air going up and down in your lungs. Not letting the blood rush to our head quite yet. All right, so let's start on our elbows. Forearm plank in three, in two, in one. Here we go. Hold it steady. So, like I said, we're used to a minute at the end of our classes, right? Today's going to be less. Yes, we have more, but you get that little bit of break in between. Okay, we've got it. Hold it. Halfway. Breathe in. And when we take our rest, you guys, I want you to take a full, full rest. So don't just stay on your hands or your elbows. Take some time off. Make sure you push back to maybe child's pose, kneeling, something like that. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Slowly lower. Come on off the wrist, come on off the hands. We're gonna go into a high plank. Hands are down, arms are straight, wrists are right underneath the shoulders. Five, four, three, two, one, and we're up. So as always, you can choose to come onto the knees. If you need a little rest, maybe you go down dog. Okay? And then eventually find your way back to your plank. Nice strong plank, nice long line from the top of your head to your heels. Hold it, we've got 20 seconds to go. Last 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, lower. 
come off those wrists. We've got one more and I'm gonna give you the option. You can do any plank that you want. You can do a back plank. Okay, you can do a high plank. You can do an elbow plank. Whatever you wanna do. Three, two, and one. I'm choosing on my elbows, my forearms. Okay, you can go here, you can do dolphin. Okay, you can tap the shoulders. We did already do that though. So kind of just acknowledge that, I guess. You can do side plank. Get your third plank in, whatever you would like to do. You can shift. You've got 20 seconds. Last 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and you're done. Good job, you guys. Awesome work. Sit on your heels for a second. And let's just go shoulder stretch. We have time to stretch, you guys. It's four till, so please take this time. We're going to take it slow in our stretch today. Go ahead and switch arms. fingers behind the back. Open up for a chest stretch. To be honest, my hands are a little bit sweaty from the workout, so it might be difficult if you're with me. Awesome. Go ahead and release. Shake them out. Crisscross them over. Take the left arm and bring it behind your back for a tricep stretch. Take that right arm back for a tricep stretch. And release. Come on to all fours. Move through a couple cat cows on your own. Stretch and out the back. Like me, it feels good to flip my wrists around so my fingertips are facing my knees. A little bit of a forearm stretch. Good. Turn it back around and release. Bring that right leg forward. Press through that left hip. Make sure that your right knee is not going over your right toes. Go ahead and switch. Pressing through that right hip flexor. I have a little bit of a twist up to you. Go ahead and bring the hands to bring that uh, left foot and then step it all the way up to the top of your mat. Okay, you're in forward fold, stretching out your hamstrings, maybe bending into one knee and out of the other. And then roll it up. Awesome. Shake out the shoulders. Reach for your left ankle. I just see my imagination, but that song got really loud. Quad stretch. Pulling that left quad so it's even with or behind slightly that right quad. Shake it out, release. Grab onto that right ankle. And release. Inhale, bring the arms up. I'm gonna do one more forward fold. Get those hamstrings stretched out well. If it feels better for you to heel toe the feet out wide, do that. Roll it up to stand. You guys are all set. Have a great rest of your week. 
um, or week out, I apologize. And then next week, I will see you for core on Tuesday. Bye, guys.